Okay, welcome back to the Let's Play. So this should be episode four, I believe. And what I'm going to start doing is doing a little bit of prettifying in this episode. So, um, death point. Anyways, <laughs> okay, let's get to it. So uh, I did do a little bit off screen. All I did though was I put the met all the ores I had in here, let them melt down, and then put all the dusts in here. Let them melt down in here on furnace only mode and spit out the contents over here. So now we've got a whole bunch of ores. Um, I mean, not much I can get started. <laughs> Derp. Okay, but the goals for this are I'm gonna get this pathway going, expand that room a little bit, I think, and um, probably get some storage going over there. And then deeper in that way, I wanna make a um, like grow room. Uh, to grow magic crops and get my magic crops going because magic crops is really awesome uh, it, It's just gonna be super awesome for us um, So first things first We have to burn two diamonds for this process uh, for two different things First thing we need to do is we're gonna need to burn a diamond and a stick like this to get the diamond chisel from chisel 2 what this will let us do is going to have a couple functions. It's kind of like the regular chisel, but the regular chisel, when you right click, you put the block that you want to chisel. So for example, say we want to chisel cobblestone in here, and then it'll only let us make a particular type of this, you know, and we just make it and then we take it back out and we put it back here in the world. But say for example, I want to chisel um, the cobblestone into, let's say, these cobblestone, right? I can put that in there. Now I can just chisel blocks in the world that are um, the same type. But you'll notice since this is just regular, or this is stone, which is not cobblestone, it won't work here. But if I go in cobblestone, it'll let me chisel all the cobblestone into that if I want to. Now, um, the other thing it lets me do is it lets me um, change the um, the method. So if I th I think if I have this right, what it'll let me do is if I put in a bunch here and then go panel uh, or column, it's going to give me nope that did not have any change. In it. What does this do? Mode. Never mind, I have no clue what that mode does. <laughs> okay, anyhow, but uh, you can see here there's all kinds of different things we can chisel it to be, um, which is all cool and dandy. But what I want to do is I want to see this ditrite. What does this turn into? Um, looks like it just turns into nothing. Can we cook this stuff? Um, this stuff is kind of lame. Okay, um, we're over that. So we're gonna use, um, I think we're gonna use this because this is a nice block. It expands things out, um, and that's that's cool. Now, one thing we want to check though is we want to check what stone options we have because we could do something like this. That looks kind of cool, but I think that's going to be too much of a pain. If we have, you know, that's nice and all, but the cobblestone is just going to be easier because we already have the, um, we already have it. You know, we, we can make it really easy. It's not big, big of a deal. We don't have to cook it, nothing like that. So we just pop these like this. All right, and these count as chisel blocks now. So, oh, that is a way to not need to cook blocks back into stone. When I want them to be stone. That is convenient. That is very convenient. I did not know that. <laughs> I just found something new. Okay. Um. Anywho, <laughs> learning time. You learn something new every day, as they say. 
Was that coal underneath there? I think that was coal. That was coal. Hey. We need more coal. Um. Here we go. So, now, if... This is another cool thing, is if you don't have it targeted on something, you can see all the different options that you have. With it. But, um... Ooh, that's actually a kind of nice option. But anyways, the option I want is... this one. So, now we can pop that sucker. And we're going to need to lift this up for a second. Actually, I want to put that there anyways. So. Okay, and oh, just pop that up. Pop that up. Throw down cobble. Pop it. Actually, you know what? No. I, I want smooth stone under there. So, all we have to do is take these smooth stone blocks, pop them down there, and then we chisel that smooth stone back into regular stone, put it in there, and boom, boom, there we go. Awesome, that looks cool. And we're gonna put one there. So tell me what you guys think um, of the base in the comments below. Um, I'd like to hear your thoughts on what you think of the decoration. Um, do you think it's good? Do you think it's bad? If you think it's bad, what do you think I should do differently? You know, um, I want to hear from you guys. I like being able to talk to my community. I really like streaming. Uh, the only th thing, though, is <sighs> streaming Minecraft, I get DOS attacked. Every single time I stream Minecraft on Twitch, I get attacked. So that kind of got me over streaming Minecraft on Twitch. Um, which is why I haven't really streamed it uh, lately, if any of you have seen my stream um, and are wondering why I'm just playing instead of streaming. That is why. Um, okay, someone is messaging me. Oh well, we're going to have to wait. And any of you... Uh, who heard that in the background, yes, that was the TARDIS uh, as my ringtone. Um, because I will hear the TARDIS over any amount of noise. <laughs> so anytime my phone rings, uh, my Whovian friends get uh, kind of annoyed sometimes by hearing the TARDIS and getting all excited. Okie dokie. So, um, the next thing we need to do is we need to
We need to not be distracted by things. Sorry. <laughs> That's what happens when I don't do any cutting of videos. Stuff like that happens. Um, okay, so the other thing we need to do is in here we need to take some diamond and surround that with uh, this essence dust and that's going to give us a weak infusion stone now what this will let us do is we can actually go and surround that like that and it'll give us weak essence so I'm going to show you in a second what that can do for us so I need four of those weak essence um, and I have any seeds. Um, burst plant seeds. No, I just need regular seeds. I don't have any regular seeds. Oh my gosh. Okay, I really need a transmutation table. Do we have any transmutation? Tran. Transmu. Trans. Mutations. There we go. Transmutation tablet. Um, do, 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 do. Oh, we need obsidian for that. Um, okay, we can do obsidian. We can do obsidian. Uh, we've got just enough diamonds to make a diamond pickaxe. And we're actually going to make a turtle instead of just a diamond pickaxe because. That would be a waste. So, um, I actually want to make a golden turtle because those have a color interface and I like color. Okay. And we ore doubled anyways, so why not? Um, we'll also need some glass. So, let's grab us some sand. And we're going to go ahead and throw that sand into there. And that'll cook up in here. Yeah, that's going to cook three at a time. We actually need that, so let's wait for that to finish cooking. Come on, you can do it. Come on! Come on, buddy! You can do it! You can do it, man! There we go. Okay, so... Um, and by the way, most things can be chiseled. I mean, for example, see, I can even chisel the um, glass. So and there's some pretty cool variants of glass in here. So that's something worth noting. And with the di uh, with the diamond chisel, you can um, chisel glass, and then um, you know you can put glass into the world. And then if you change your mind later and you want a different glass, you just change it with the chisel. So that's it's, it's really cool. Okay, so um, we need three. Oh, I think we need another row because we need those panes, glass panes. Uh, which is a pain in my butt. Also, all this running around sucks with no food. So there we go, glass panes, and then. Actually, I'm going to throw some of this stuff in here. Don't need that, don't need that, don't need that, don't need that, don't need that. Okay. Um, turtle. Whoops. Turtle. Base turtle is a chest and a computer, and the computer is smooth stone. Um, I'm going to do something a little bit hacksy here. What we're going to do is we're going to change these into bricks from chisel. Okay. And then, what we're going to do is we're going to mine them. And because they're chisel bricks, we pick up the brick, which means that we just picked up the smooth stone. Kind of like if you had silk touch. So, that's awesome. Um, 
so it's kind of like a cheap silk touch for things that um, can be chiseled. So now all we got to do to get those back is we take all the stone blocks, put them in there, change it back into stone. There we go. And we'll want to keep one uh, just because if we don't have that one, we won't be able to uh, make more of that easily. So let's go here. Then we need the computer, which we have the stuff for now. So pop that sucker there. OK, and we need a chest, which we do not have the stuff for. We have another chest. There we go. So now we're going to make a chest, one of those. Then we're going to go and we're gonna make that. Why? What? What's going on? Can we not make advanced turtles? Maybe advanced turtles are turned off. That would suck. Or maybe turtles in general are turned off. If turtles in general are turned off, I'm going to have to go yell at my settings for a little bit. Um, but let's just hope that they're not, because um, that would be stupid. OK, so um, okay, I guess it's just golden turtles are turned off, which is annoying. Anyway, so you can put whatever you want on the side there. You can put a hoe, you can do a pickaxe. You can do um, a felling act or felling turtle by putting a regular axe on the side. You can put a shovel. I've never put anything other than a pickaxe because I don't think it really matters. Um, I haven't had any problems doing it otherwise. Ooh, a magnet turtle. That's interesting. Um, hmm. Why is it not showing me the recipe for that particular turtle? Ah, oh well. Okay, let's find it. Do, 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 do. Okay, I'm over it. Um, I'll figure that out off screen probably if I care anyhow um, looks like I'm about to die so we're going to do something to protect my XP so let's go over here and we're gonna throw this sand in here. and we're gonna make some XP grates and portable tanks portable tanks um, portable, da, 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 da. not the creative one, that one. Okay, uh, copper and glass. Okay, can do. And for now, I should, well, no, I think I'm going to need two tanks. Um, and actually, if I can upgrade to the second tank, that's going to be much better and I think I can make some Ingvar that's probably not too hard to make Ingvar blend Ooh, I'm gonna have to bring some stuff back down to ore I think um, so let's see Let's do five, so that me or let's do four. Yeah, so it's gonna be four and four. So uh, there we go, and that'll actually just go turn that back into ore. It's a little bit wasteful that way, but our, our dust. Sorry, we'll turn it back into dust. It's a little bit wasteful, but oh well. What can you do? Um. Table. 
So we're going to make the first portable tank here. Okay, there we go. And then now the second one we need to surround with Ingvar, which we're going to make over here. Oh, let's let that finish. Um, and in the meantime, we're going to make the grates. So what we do is we take these and we have to fill up the whole thing. So we actually need some more iron for this. So there we go. And we just go fill that up and that'll make some XP drains. And actually I'm going to go and make a couple more so that um, when you're walking in um, across this portion here, it'll have grates. Or no, I want to do right over here. So when you're when you're standing on it here, it's going to be uh, chipping away your EXP. Yes, that sounds good. And then I can have like a little maintenance thing underneath. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, good. So uh, we come over here and oops, over there, uh, over here. And we're gonna change this to alloys only. And then, actually no, we're gonna put it back to smelting. Furnace only, furnace only, there we go. And we're gonna combine these like so. There we go, Ingvar blend. And we're gonna cook all that Ingvar blend. And that's gonna give us, uh, let's see, nine, 12. So it'll give us 12 Ingvar, which should be enough for more than we need. So. Come on, almost, almost there. Dun 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 Okay, put the tank in the center. And then Ingvar there, 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 and there. And then we get the better one. Okay, so Ingvar, Ingvar. Tank. Ingvar. Ingvar. And Ingvar. Yes. There we go. Now these portable tanks can hold so much more than the other ones. See these? If you hold shift, these can hold twenty are thirty-two buckets. So millibuckets, there's a thousand millibuckets in a bucket. So these can hold thirty-two buckets, whereas the other one could only hold eight buckets. So big upgrade. Okay, so let's see here. We're gonna put it here and there. And there. And let's plop them down. Oh, and actually, uh, right now we're only going to do the one. So we're going to pull this back up. Actually, I'm not even going to bother with that right now. First, I'm going to put the grate down, and I'm going to drain my XP because it's in bad shape right now. Okay, so now the cool thing is, check it out, it's in there. So if we wanna get that back, we just do XP shower. So yeah, XP shower. So we do the XP shower, hook it up to that tank, bam, the XP comes flowing out and goes on to us, or we can use the XP bottler, which will put it into XP bottles. Um, so yeah, it's, it's cool and nifty. Um, so it's another way to get XP bottles other than the normal vanilla way of getting XP bottles. Which I guess is just finding them? I don't know. Oh wow, this is taking forever. Okay, let's, let's go die. Um... I'm gonna just be energetic here in the corner. And then die on the floor. 
There we go. Okay. Now I don't want to make a space race. And then we go and do this. And we didn't lose all our EXP, which is awesome. Okay. So do that. And now we should be able to just pop this sucker up. There we go. And we'll go and put another one below it, like so. And we're going to put the roof back on here. Boop. Okay. And... Then, let's see here. Boop. Awesome. That still looks awesome from over here. We can cross that. It, if we had done it three, then there would be this weird glitch where we wouldn't be able to get in here, which would be really annoying. Um, we'd have to, like, shift and then go in, I think, to get in. Anyways, it's just super annoying and not worth our time to do. So, um, let's mine out this wall here. And we're going to expand that a little bit. So this episode has been primarily the decoration episode, but uh, next episode we're going to get some, um, uh, some what's it call it going. Some of the, the magical plants, sorry. It's, it's late. My brain was not so awake. Um, let's see here. We're doing this one, right? Yep. Ooh. Interesting. What does that look like? Oh, that's lame. It's not a connected texture. I like the connected texture ones. Where did you go? Don't forsake me, Torch. Okay. Um, and then let's get rid of this. Because we're going to be moving these back later. But I need to make a... Um, what is it called? A wrench. Or we're going to have some troubles. Oh yeah, transmutation and magical plants. That's going to be the next episode. Transmutation and magical plants. Okay, there we go. That looks sexy. Nice. Okay. And actually, let's undo that. So... Let's see how it works, actually, if we go... And go up like that with this. How does that look? That actually looks pretty cool. That looks pretty badass, actually. Nice. Okay. Anyways, we are nearing the end of this episode, so um, I'm going to start saying Alveda Zen. So, um, have a great day or night or whatever it is for all of you out there, and I hope you're having as much fun watching this as I'm having playing it um, and, you know, uploading these clips for you guys. Um, if you have anything in particular you'd like to see in relation to the mods, please let me know. Um, I'm very open to suggestion. And 
Um, remember to rate, comment, subscribe, all that jazz, because it really does help out um, media creators like myself, content creators, um, because it helps us get our videos ranked higher. Um, without the support of my viewers, I can't really get anywhere. Um, so if you like it, please do rate and comment and subscribe and all that stuff. Give thumbs up. Give subscribes while you're watching. All that jazz. It all goes into Google's metrics servers and whatnot and, and helps me get higher ranking in the videos. So, uh, doing that would be awesome. Okay. Let's see here. So, you know, I'm thinking, okay, tell me in the comments if you guys think I should make, like, a, a separate Let's Play series for when I'm doing um, decoration of the base. Because uh, that could be a good thing to do on its own, just by itself. Just do a separate video set for decoration. I mean, as you notice, this whole episode <laughs> was just decoration. And it's still going. It's, it's over time. Like, I, I'm... I'm significantly past the uh, 30 minutes I like to keep the episodes to, um, and so yeah, that's it's something worth noting uh, that it does take a bit to decorate, and it's not just like I'm being slow or something. It's just it <laughs> decorating takes a while. Um, you know, Minecraft is not the quickest thing in the world when you wanna do making things look nice and everything but um yep anyhow okay so as soon as i get this finished up i'm going to be signing out okay here we go boom ba -da -da. almost there Okay, what do you guys think so far? So I'm gonna have this main hallway and I'm gonna be closing up these, these gaps here. So like, you know, it'll be something, you know, there's gonna be like wall, right? And then, and then wall up this way, right? Like that. And then wall here. And then let's see, one, two, three. So then some wall here, probably like that. And then uh, closing up this area here. And yeah, so what do you guys think about this? Do you think that this looks good? And I'm going to be um, probably closing this up some too or something like that. Um, and then so you'll come in here and then you can go this way and you can go through here and then it has this room I'm probably gonna do something with the walls. I don't know yet what I want to do with the walls But yeah, so what do you guys think so far? Do you think do you think this looks cool? I'm kind of going like a Mines of Moria style almost um, Yeah Give me comments in the in the in the commenty doobly do down below and have a great day